Well, freezing temperatures can cause fruit loss or even tree damage for avocado growers. That's why local farmers are doing all they can to protect their crops. KSBY News reporter Alexa Bertola has details on what one farm is doing. Protecting their avocados is their number one priority. This farm in particular does not want history to repeat itself. Back in 2013, it lost all of its avocados due to freezing temperatures. Now, years later, it has new protocols in place to ensure this does not happen again. Nestled in Sisquoc, about seven miles from Highway 101 in Santa Maria, is Rancho Tepesque Orchards. There are over 80 acres of avocados alongside a handful of wind machines that can be used when the temperatures plummet. That move the air, that mix the warm air with the cold. Seferino Gutierrez has taken care of the avocado orchard for the last 10 years. He says the wind machines save the orchard. 31 degrees or 30, we have damage in avocados, fruits, you know, trees. We need to take care and we have a, the big fan. Once they get the notification it's 31 degrees or colder, they fire up the machines and they run for about eight hours. This morning we start like three o'clock. In a four month frost period, the machines are used about a dozen times. But for the past three days, they've cranked up the machines. This is uncommon to start off February. Usually when we have our issues, is in December, January. There's a lot at stake. These avocados have been on the tree since April of last year and are getting ready to be pulled by March or April. New flowers will soon come through with new fruit for 2020. Back in 2013, the frost was so bad they had to stump the orchard. We have it like 21 degrees. The wind machines were not yet installed, but this winter they're proving to be a success with no damage on the 9,600 trees. We need to take care of you know, the whole winter. It's very important. The orchard says that it's planning on using the machines again on Monday and Tuesday. In Sisquoc, Alexa Bertola, KSBY News. All right, Alexa, wine grapes on the property will start being protected in March with sprinklers.